Randy, you were talking a lot about song choice last night. Where did some of the contestants go wrong? What happened? I think, you know, Ryan, it's really funny, man. I think, you know, we talk about the song being the wrong choice for you, it being too big for you. As I said last night, you could love something, but it doesn't mean that you're going to sing it well. So it's just kind of funny to me that when we gave them a genre this wide, maybe it was too wide, that, hey, sing whatever you want, current or whatever, and they still pick songs that just weren't mm -hmm, them. Mm -hmm. And, Kara, you, you were heckled a little bit last night from the audience. I thought you were going to get into it with somebody back there. <laughs> what happened? You know, kind of feels like I'm part of the gang now, right? I've been heckled, but... You know, I I appreciate the audience and their passion, and no, yes, I do appreciate that. She I mean, does, I think that does. it's a great she thing does. that they love their idols and yeah, that they yeah, want to yeah. fight for them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love that about the audience. Yeah. But you know, I'm here to do a job and to help these kids, and if that means I'm going to get booed, then okay, boo me. Right? Come on, boo! Let's you know, that's it. Paula, you said that Adam shattered expectations. What do some of the other contestants have to do to keep up with him? Well, Ryan, you know, this the foundation of this business, as you know, takes hard, hard work. And being blessed with talent, well, it can get you through the door if you're lucky enough. And I consider you guys the luckiest ones of all to have the world's greatest platform to perform on. But for me, it's about knowing who you are and delivering that confidence with conviction week in and week out that's what gets me so enthusiastic and I did point out Adam Lambert last night but, in, but I also know in my heart of hearts that each and every one of you possesses that potential so go for it let yourselves go and have fun and Simon, we're going to get to the results in just a little bit, but thinking about the show last night and looking at the top nine, yes. in your mind, yes. if you were choosing, who do you think should leave tonight? Ah. Oh. I'd say if I was up there now, who would I be, I'd, who, who should be worried? Anoop? Matt? Megan? Can you stop there? I'll stop there. Stop there, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I love the impersonations. Wait, G Goki, uh, you can do you can do one of Matt though, can you? Wait, here's Danny doing yeah. Matt G. Do you guys this. remember his uh, Coldplay? Oh. Here's how it is. <laughs> I used to rule. <laughs> 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 Can do Chris. Oh, yeah, okay. So. Watch this. How sweet it is to be loved by. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> and I Irahita, who do you awesome. want to do? You, can, you, you do. Who do you do? I do Danny Goki. All right, Irahita does Danny Goki. Watch. You guys remember the PYT? P-Y-T <laughs> I want to love you <laughs> No, 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 you got I, 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 I'll check this out Go ahead. How do you do Jesus take the wheel? How do I do it? <laughs> Jesus take the wheel <laughs> <laughs> Almost You guys are getting along better than any other idols in years past, I can tell <laughs> Okay, let's shift gears and find out who is headed where this evening. Are you ready for the results? Yeah. All right, we're going to build the bottom three. Dim the lights. Here we go. Megan, would you please stand up? <laughs> Matt, please stand up. And Chris, would you stand up? Matt, Megan, Chris, come down here. Head to the far side of the stage, please. Stand next to each other. Oh, jeez. This is, this is changing my plan. <laughs> pink, pink. There you go. All right. Let's go to Adam. Please stand up. Pop up. And 
and Allison, please stand up. Can I have you three, please, head to the center of the stage? Hey. <laughs> Scott, stand up right there, sir. Danny, you too? After the nationwide vote, Anoop, please stand up. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna have you come this way on this side of the stage. Scott, right here is good. Danny, and Anoop. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, take a look at this. This is what you got. Who is safe? And which one of these groups could be the bottom three? Did America get this right? Find out. Plus, back to the live on Idol. Last night, you weighed in, and I have your results right here. Tonight, the ride could end for someone unless the judges jump to their rescue. Bring down the lights. Let's get to the cards and start with Chris. You sang Ain't No Sunshine. The judges all loved your clever and cool arrangement and said it was your best performance of the competition so far. After the nationwide vote, Chris. You are safe. You may take a seat on the couch. <laughs> Matt. You sang You Found Me. The judges thought it was more like a sound alike performance. Kara added. You don't deserve to go home. You still feel like he does not deserve to go home, Kara? 100%. 100%. Matt, any regrets after last night's performance? No regrets. Just looking Zero forward. Zero regrets. Just looking forward. After the nationwide vote, Matt, last week you were in the bottom three. And this week, you're also going to have to take a seat. Oh, all right. <laughs> Matt, over there. Oh. So Matt and Chris are safe. Megan, ladies and gentlemen. You sang Turn Your Lights Down Low. The judges all thought you went with the wrong song. Simon added it was boring, indulgent, and monotonous. Paula encouraged you to show your softer side in the future. How'd you feel after what Simon said last night? I love you, Simon, but I didn't really care. Be I love you, but I don't care, she said, Simon. I like her. That's not true. After the nationwide vote, Megan, you can also take a seat, but unfortunately, ah! here. Ah! In our bottom three tonight. All right. Up next is Lil. You sang I Surrender. The judges all agreed that the song wasn't right for you. They know you can sing. Simon said your performance is something like at a wedding, though. After the nationwide votes, Lil. You are safe. Okay, Allison, you sang Don't Speak. The judges thought your outfit was distracting, and you seemed like a wannabe rocker. But Randy and Paula did give you props for breaking out your guitar. Did you think that outfit was going to get all that attention? Not really. Yeah. Will you go back to that spiky hair again? Yes, I will. You will. <laughs> <laughs> 
after the vote, Allison, you are in the bottom three. Unfortunately, so sit next to Megan over there in the stools. Hi, son. <laughs> what we got for you? Okay. Hey, familiar too. Lambert, you sang. Play that funky music. The judges all praised your brave and bold performance. Paula even compared you to Steven Tyler and Mick Jagger. After the vote, Adam Lambert, you are safe. You may take a seat on the couch. All right, now these three. Let's start with Danny. Goki, you sang What Hurts the Most. The judges all loved your emotional and moving rendition. You left Kara with goosebumps. And Simon said it was your best performance to date. America voted. Danny, you are safe. Take a seat on the couch, bro. Yes, I made it to ass. <laughs> so now on stage, we've got Scott and Anoop. Scott, you sang just the way you are. The judges all agreed with your choice to strip down the song and thought it did pay off. Simon and Randy added that it was one of the best of the night. Anoop. You sang, caught up. The judges thought your vocals were good, but the performance and arrangement lacked originality. Simon added, it was like a college boy trying to be a pop star and failing. <laughs> One of these people is safe, ladies and gentlemen. One of them is in the bottom three. Randy, you don't know the results. Who do you think is the person headed to the bottom three. Dude, you know what, judging on last night though, man, I think it has to be a noob, man, because Scott did his thing, baby. So you think it's, it's you in the bottom three, not Scott? I, I have a feeling, and you know, watching the performance back, I can understand it too. Scott. Yes. I'm going to pull you over here to the couches. Take a seat. Anoop, you are in the bottom three of the school. So this is your bottom three, America. One of these people could be leaving tonight on American Idol. We will have to wait a little bit to find out who faces the fire, because after the break, before we go to break, before we take a break, Simon, three faces. How many worth saving, in your opinion? One. Just one? Yeah. On that note, we'll be right back. Stay with us. Back with you on American Idol. This is your bottom three. A new Megan and Allison. So, let's send one of them back to safety now. This person who will compete again next week and can relax for the rest of the evening on the couch is Allison. Congratulations. Thank you. Now we have got Megan and Anu. These two people got the lowest number of votes. The person who came in at the bottom and faces elimination is Megan. It's okay. Anu, you are safe. Don't forget the call. Megan Joy. Wait a minute. We're going to have you sing here in just a second. Okay. 
Simon, will you be using the save tonight on Megan? Uh, Megan, with the greatest respect, uh, when you said that you don't care, uh, nor do we. Um, so I'm not going to pretend that we're even going to contemplate saving you. Okay. So this is your swan song. Enjoy it. So, so you're not going to evaluate the performance? No. Okay. That's it. That's it. That's it. Well, let's hear from Megan Joy one more time. Here she goes one more Thank time you. on American Idol. Megan Joy. I want you to turn lights down low and open up your window curtain and let the moon come shining in into our lives again See you go. You know, um, I would just like to say a couple things. One, thank you everybody that works on Idol. The contestants, you guys are the best! <laughs> Judges, I love you. America, I love you. And baby, I'm coming home, baby. I'm coming home. Let's take a look at her highlights on the show. Watch this. One of my favorite auditions. Because you're different, you know, you are one of the few I'm gonna remember. When I tried out for American Idol, my family and friends made me. And I was like, I'm never going to make it, you guys. This is ridiculous. I'm just going to get shut down like every other time in my life. You know I'm a dreamer, but my heart's a goal. I have a two-year-old son. I love you, Baba. Lower kiss. Oh, big hug. Oh, I miss him so much. Way of putting your signature on everything you touch. It's just so Megan from your style to the way you sing. I don't want to change who I am. That's what I want to do, even if it's not safe. I'm going to walk the plank, and it's my plank, and let's party. Megan is one of the most original contestants that I think you've ever had on the show. You're interesting, you're relevant, you're hip, you're beautiful. You did everything right. Uh, it was a blast. I'm going to take away nothing but good memories. Mama is headed home. Megan Joy, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks to all of you for watching each week. Thank you to our judges, Randy Carapola and Simon. Thanks to Ricky Miner and the band, as always. We appreciate your voting. We appreciate you being with us every Tuesday and Wednesday. Next week, the top eight will take on songs from the year they were born. That's next week. Stay tuned now for your local news. From Hollywood, good night, everybody.